Hey folks, this is D-Dub. Haven't done a video in a while, especially not for Monster, my giant African bullfrog. So I was at the Reptile Expo today and I found some really cool little treats for him. Hornworms. So I've got about 10 of them today that I'm going to feed for you. Show you here. And he's pretty hungry. Tried to go after my hand when I fed him. Here's one, buddy. Get it. Oh yeah, he's hungry. It's right there in front of you. Get it. Oh yeah, he likes them. Those paper towels might have been a bad idea. Hopefully he doesn't ingest any of that. And as a tribute to my uh, good buddy, Staff Sergeant Abrams, U.S. Army, he said this is going to be a bloodbath. Want it, monster? You like them? You never had anything like that before, have you? Nice job, bud. So I got these hornworms from Joey Muggleston of Joey Muggleston Exotics. Really cool guy to work for, work with, I should say. Uh, he's always treated me right. Really nice guy, very informative as usual. Well, you want me to just put it in your mouth or what, buddy? Sorry about the lighting here. It's kind of an awkward thing. If you get it at the right angle, it shows up good. If I don't, the lighting kind of sucks. Get it, bud. So these hornworms make a pretty good treat. Not something you want to feed all the time, but variety is the key to their diet. And these make some pretty good variety. I staple them, as you guys know, if you've watched in the past, on dubia roaches and night crawlers. And he gets a, a mouse or some kind of rodent every 60 days or so and I try to staple him with some other stuff that he wouldn't normally get in the captive setting here and these they make a pretty good little treat for him those are a little odd huh buddy? never had anything like that There you go. Guess I should have done a clear, clear cage. You can't really. He's got some nice big teeth. He's really grown up on me. Come on. Nice. Come on, stop being mad. Stop. One more. Okay. You actually got you four more, including this one, bud. If you want them. Oops. Didn't like that, did you? Want? you? you want this one? Hey, stay. You can't be getting full already, bud. What's the matter with you, huh? These hornworms are interesting creatures. They're actually tomato worms. They'll grow on to they feed on tomato leaves, I guess as well as tobacco leaves. You can find them as tobacco hornworms or tomato hornworms. You can see they got kind of a little horn right here on their back end. Held on to that one instead of letting him have it. You about done? Getting filled up on them? Get it. Oh, you're gonna fall. He doesn't care to be touched. I'm gonna sit down here without changing too much. Mason. Mason. Should be able to see a pretty okay. cool tongue shot if he'll go for this thing again. <clears throat> what are you doing? Do you wanna eat it or not? 
You act like you want out. Mm-hmm. Don't want it, bud, huh? You about filled up? Give you a rest for a second? Well, I'll show you. So he's pretty big now. If I uh, give you a reference, I'll put my hand down here on him. He's probably about maybe seven and a half, eight inches from snout to vent. Oh, you crazy son of a gun. Yeah, the horn one's just trying to escape here. Get in there, no buggers. And this is what Monster looked like when he was a little baby. He's got this little guy. If I can find him here. He's probably hiding out from me. He needs his water change. He just got home. Maybe. That's what Monster looked like before. Just a little tiny guy. And they are still that? just as voracious at this size. He would try to eat one of those hornworms if I gave him one, but you can see he's just a little tiny guy. And I'm thinking this might be a male. We'll see. He's got a nice broad head for a little guy. Once I raise him up and he's a male for sure, I will probably be selling him. So if you're interested in that, make sure you uh, watch on uh, Frog Forum, Pac-Man Frogs USA. The monster's trying to come after this one that's moving around here. And he's ready for another one, I guess. Come on. Let's hey, stop get him one down here. Hey, stop. You on me, little son of a bitch. Come here. Ready for that, bud? Let me switch hands here. It's okay. No more letters? You're okay. Trying to be your friend, you little butthead. Come on, Mason. Go ahead, bud. I think he's getting filled up. He might eat a couple more if I put him back in his cage. Oh, there he goes. Get it, bud. Oh, I keep moving around and he goes for it. Paper towel. Do something different here. Hey, Allison, will you grab this paper towel out of here when I lift him up? See how big he is. I bet he'll dry, eat these if I drop them on the ground in front of him here. You all full monster, huh, bud? Okay. Probably call it quits here in just a second if he doesn't get this one. You done? Okay. We'll call that done. All right, again, D-Dub, thanks for watching. Uh, check out Joey Muggleston Exotics. Just Google it. Got some cool stuff. Sold me these hornworms at the Reptile Expo in Utah.